So, Miss Virgin, how are you doing? I'm blessed and highly favored. Awesome, awesome. So we are here. We want to talk about your empowerment house experience. Yes. We, we recall when uh, you filled out the application, did the interview, and uh, the team selected you uh, to come and go into the empowerment house. So, so tell us, what was going on? How was life? prior to going into the apartment house? Uh, well, um, I was in, living in a complex building um, for five years um, out of some not expecting. Mm -hmm. um, they de um, denied me to be there and they only gave me a month to move. Um, my sons, grandbabies and daughter-in-law was living with me. So it was unexpected, I didn't know where to go. So um, I came to the Kingdom Church that day. I will never forget. I was talking to Sister Barbara mm -hmm. and you, for some reason, heard the conversation. And after I left, you called me and said, why you don't apply for the Empowerment House? Mm -hmm. And even though I knew about the Empowerment House, I said, but you know, what about those people that need and maybe they need more than me. So you pushed me <laughs> to do the application, which I did. So um, I got the call that I was um, <laughs> chosen. And um, you know, that's how we did it. How, how was your Empowerment House experience? Well, first of all, um, the program has a lot of um, open doors. And the person that comes into the power and home, if they take advantage of all those programs that they have to offer, it's a blessing. Awesome. Um, to God be the glory, we was able to experience each process. Um, I took the um, partnership job. Yeah, job partnership. Uh, yes, yes, and um, it was an uh, impact in my life. It was such a blessing um, just to be able to experience that class. It meant a lot. That was the first thing that I would say that impact my life. Um, to encourage people to about the program that, you know, it, it just, um, if I see somebody that is need in those areas to get a better job, or, you know, I talk about the, the experience that I have with that program. Um, also, you know, um, there, there's a lot of step, you know, uh, financial, yes. real estate, um, spiritual. So um, not only in me, but in, in the impact that it did into my son's and my daughter-in-law's life. You know, um, they, they experienced faith in this journey and um, pushed them to grow, pushed them, you know, they have the, always the desire to buy a home. So um, this program helped us to reach that goal. Wow. So. Wow, so, so, so we see a holistic program yes. that, that you know, you know, cater to the total being. Mm -hmm. And uh, the end goal is uh, we, we want to get our families into a better place. Uh, and you all were, were able to get into a new home, praise God. Praise God, hallelujah. Uh, yeah, praise yes. God, a new home. And so, uh, so that's where we are, so now, you all have transitioned out of the house. Praise and God. God has blessed you all uh, to be in a, a new home. Tell us, yes. how was that experience? Oh my goodness, um, it was a journey. Um, it has its ups and down. Um, it's just standing by faith and knowing that, you know, God is stable wow. all the way. And I, you know, sometimes if we look things in our flesh, we won't see clear. So we ask, I ask God to reveal to me in the spirit, not to doubt, but to stand in his word that, you know, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be a blessing. So um, in that journey, um, you know, 
we have learned so much. We have grown so much, not only on my behalf, but in my son's and daughter-in-law's life, even my grandbabies. Okay. You're seeing the smile of my grandbaby having her own room and enjoying and decorating. It's a blessing by himself. So I, I, to God be the glory. I cannot say no more to praise God because he was the one who favored us and to be in this process, in this journey. And my advice is to those that doesn't have hope or going through the same situation or worse, you know, there's hope. If you walk by faith and, and, and you take, you know, put God first and know that God will never leave you, that there's hope for you, you know. And this program, my prayer is to grow more, not only to just one house, but more house, multiple house, that be able to give the opportunity to those families the same or more that we have. So, so here it is, family. I, I mean, that's why we do it. Uh, the Empowerment House is, is set up for us to do just what happened with Ms. Virgin and her family. Um, we're currently uh, expanding our empowerment house layout, uh, preparing to uh, do more homes. And so we're currently renovating the home that Ms. Virgin was in. So we want to thank Attorney Francis for the uh, generous donation to help us uh, do renovations to our home because we want those that are in the house uh, to know that uh, we care and know that uh, we're giving them a nice setup. Uh, it, it's, it's no junk. It's uh, something that's uh, set up nice for the families. And, and so uh, that's why we do it. That's why we do the Empowerment House. And for those who are looking for uh, to uh, opportunity to get forward, uh, we want you to email us uh, at empowermenthouse at tkci.org. It's empowermenthouse at tkci.org. Email us and let us know that you're interested uh, to, for an opportunity. You get six months in, six months, we put your funds into an account, an escrow account, and after that, when you're preparing to move, that all those funds go back to you. And not only do we do that, we all the programs that Ms. Virgin spoke about, you have an opportunity to go through all of those programs, job partnership, uh, financial uh, planning and counseling and all of those things that we have laid out for you all. And after that, we stay in touch with you to ensure that you are meeting your goals to be where you are. That's why we do what we do. God bless you all.